Hello all, welcome back to my YouTube channel. So guys, in this particular video, we have two agendas which we'll be exploring on. So first, we'll be implementing Google's Gemini. I'll be taking a code and I'll execute Google Gemini practically and I'll show you all in front of you, but not in my laptop. So there is a platform called Project IDX from Google, which they have released uh, recently where you can get the access and the advantage of this particular platform is that uh, you can write the code even if your laptop is a low configuration and if you are not able to execute the high level codes then you can definitely use this uh, web page to write the codes and everything will be stored on your google's vm so it can handle all the high level codes related to data science data analysis even machine learning so we'll be uh, exploring about this particular project IDX that is our agenda too. So guys now let's not waste our time. Let's dive into my computer screen and discuss more about this particular platform. So make sure those who have not subscribed the channel do subscribe the channel and on the bell notification and also share this particular video with your friends who are planning to buy a new laptop because of the configuration issues. So this will definitely be helpful for them this particular website. So guys, this is the platform which I was telling you all about Project IDX uh, which was introduced by Google. So you can see here, you can read about this particular website. <coughs> if you want to be a uh, part of this particular website, make sure you connect with your Google and you will be joining the waiting list. So once they approve you, you can start using this particular website. Maybe within two weeks they'll approve it. So make sure you join this particular uh, uh, waiting list and I'll be giving you all the website uh, URL in this video description you can look on that and make sure you can join on this particular project IDX and also guys make sure you share this particular video with your friends who are planning to buy new laptop only because of the configuration issues let me just directly sign in Okay, so it's asking for the password just give me a second so i have just logged on to it and uh, just i can search project idx idx.google.com so it will take me there and where you can see i have just logged on to it and now we'll be exploring this platform this is project idx uh, platform which i got access for you can see here start building your app on the cloud so the main agenda of Google to release this particular uh, platform is that many of them are uh, having the issues with their laptop configurations, especially to the students, those who can't afford uh, the high level laptops, they can definitely use this particular web page to create your own <coughs> high level API related codes and you can write here and execute, you can even build your website. So I'll show you all the interface here, you can see there are some templates here. For web-based application, you can see here Angular, Next.js, Astro, React, everything is there. You can, if you want, even you can uh, import other templates also from your GitHub repo. It's of your choice. And backend, you can see here Python Flask is available. And Go Language, Rust and Node Express. Even for mobile, Flutter uh, UI is available here. Template, you can write the code related to Flutter. When it comes to... AI ML that is data science you can see a Gemini is available and even Plum API is available so if you just click on miss this is a blank workspace so if you don't want to use all these templates and if you have want to write your custom code just click on this blank webs uh, I mean workspace create a blank workspace and writing the code of your choice okay so now in this particular video we'll be implementing Gemini so however the generative AI is Gemini is in trending right so I'll implement Gemini in this particular video I'll execute the code and show you all in project IDX so let me just give it a name here I'll give it as YouTube and let me use Python notebook so I'll implement the notebook implementation for now so I'll just click on create you can see here it is setting up the workspace preparing the vm and building your environment 
and then finally it is finalizing the environment for us in a sense the cloud whichever is available it is going to take that cloud and it is activating it in the back end so you can see a it's building you the environment for you all let's wait for it to complete so it's about to finish so guys make sure you share this video with your friends and also do support the channel you can join me on linkedin and if you have any doubts related to anything you can definitely ask me so guys you can see here this is almost like the vs code interface once you log on to this and you can definitely use it going forward okay so i'll show you all how we will be using google gemini practically if you want to download any extensions you can definitely download here and even you can connect with your github and you can pull the, i mean push the code whatever you are writing here to your google gemini so it is setting up it is uh, environment sorry not to the google gemini to your github you can push it out whatever code you are writing okay so you can see here the setup has been done so i'll close this now it is asking me to select the kernel so i'll tell uh, python environment and i want to use venv python of 3.11.6 which it has given to me so now that's done right so it has been connected to that so api key i want to replace the api key to run this particular code from google gemini okay so let me just uh, replace this code sorry replace the api key so i want the api key now follow the link open so yeah so here i want the api key i'll just click on get api key i have my google studio so it doesn't give me that much of things so i just can okay i have deleted the previous api key so i'll just click on create api key once you click on create api key it will ask me for what uh, cloud project you are searching for so i'll just simply select generate ui lang chain client and i'll click on create the api key so i'll copy this close so this is my api key now what i'll do i'll replace the api key here and i'll run make sure no one is going to use this api key however after completing this particular uh, code whatever it is there after showing you all i'll delete this api key you can create your own api key and it's obviously free so make sure you all use it so now this is running yeah it ran successfully you can see here now prompt provide a recipe for the bark dog of the image okay so i'll just run this i'll give the prompt and finally i'll ra run this baked goods in this particular image you can see here it has created a kind of image out here so if you want you can comment this particular uh, hashtag and let's just run with this let me just explain you all this code first here we have replaced our api key okay so guys then once you are done with that you will be writing the prompt here provide a recipe for the baked goods in the image so instead of this what i'll do i'll give here provide a recipe for making andhra style uh what we can give andhra style biryani okay i'll run this okay so i'll run this code you can give your custom code of your choice why we need to use their own code let us uh try to give our own code so only i have uh, just given our own prompt so let me run this images okay these all are the images available so we have loaded the images here now what we will be doing with the help of this particular prompt right those prompt we are writing here based on this images make sure you give me the recipe to create the biryani also so i'll run this 
it's you can see here one cup of basmati rice one by two cup of chicken so you can see here it is giving me all the ingredients and instructions which i need to uh, follow to create that so this images were just simply to see the images and even there is a code written for it so based on these kind of references we are just asking it to give us the instructions here okay to create a biryani andhra style biryani okay you can see a one cup of basmati rice and everything is written and finally it is telling that it's very good so you can have a look on that wash the rice and soak it for 30 minutes and everything so you can see uh, the instructions is given clearly and the ingredients are written clearly you can create based on this let us try with different topics so let me give it here <coughs> for making Japanese famous sushi okay so I'll run this so I'll run this image images are common now let me run this so we'll see whether it can give us for sushi or not you can see here two cup of rice one one and a half cup of water one and a half cup of uh, rice vinegar and you can see here sushi grated salmon shash this is something name okay so you can read this and avocado cucumber so it is giving us what all are the things to be done and the instructions and based on this we can create our sushi so guys this is just a basic example and and the template is already available in your project IDX not only for this particular Gemini but also for Plum it is available so you can just directly search for project IDX okay you can register and later you can have a look on this you will get a mail confirmation once you register so this is done right even you have many other options that can be done you can even import your existing repo and continue working here you can try with even uh, plum api so palm api palm api is also good okay even there are some examples related to this also you can give a try over on this palm api there will be an inbuilt code for this also make sure you tweak you understand and you learn so guys that's all for today's video do like share and subscribe the channel thank you all bye bye